A town hall derailed. Congressman Chip Roy hosted a meeting with constituents in San Antonio yesterday and things escalated quickly, so much so that he walked off stage. Political anchor Ashley Godot joins us. And Ashley, before we talk about what happened, hosting actual live town halls is something that a lot of politicians really don't want to do anymore. They, they don't, Quita, and that's because town halls are dicey for politicians these days. You don't know if you're going to get constituents or protesters. So we see fewer Texas Republicans holding them. In fact, there are six Texas Republicans, Roy included, being targeted by Democrats nationally. And part of the criticism is they don't hold in-person town halls. So, or, or but, before you tip your hat to Representative Roy, Patrick Svitek with the Texas Tribune says politicians shouldn't be rewarded for doing their job. Still, last night we saw just how tense things can get. Representative Chips Roy's town hall was at Compassion Church in San Antonio. It was free and open to residents of his district, which includes parts of Austin down to San Antonio and west past Kerrville. Reporters in the room say the Republican lawmaker started by talking about his recent trip with other lawmakers to Israel. That trip in and of itself is controversial because some Democratic Congresswomen were denied entry by Israel. I'm told Representative Roy started talking about those female Democrats calling them names and why he disagrees with them on Israel. That's when things really went off the rails. Uh, people were shouting out, you know, talk about issues that uh, are important to the district we don't care about these House Democrats that you disagree with on Israel. Uh, he tried to make the argument that he was making a broader point about uh, national security issues and issues of culture and unity that do affect his congressional district. But that was no doubt the issue that set everyone off. Even people in the audience started arguing with one another. Just 20 minutes after the event started, Roy walked off the stage. He stuck around to talk with some people, then decided to get back on stage and held what's described as a more civil town hall for about 40 minutes. He talked about health care and gun violence with that one. And Svitek says Roy held his ground on why he voted against universal background checks for guns and why he's skeptical of red flag laws. And despite the debacle, he actually brought up the issue that started the drama in the first place, saying that he is not going to stand down about those issues, Quita. We have his full statement on KB.com. All right, Ashley, thank you very much.